Hello, today we're unboxing the Logitech MX Anywhere 2S Bluetooth Edition wireless mouse. Apparently it works on any surface. It's fast scrolling, rechargeable, and can control up to three Apple Mac and Windows computers and laptops. So well, let's see. So let's open this up. That box is empty. There's a manual of some sort here. Here's the English piece, a battery warning. Improperly replaced batteries may present a risk. All right. So this looks like a warning page. And this here says this, pro this product is intended to be supplied by a listed certified power supply rated 5 volt DC. Good to know. what this says it says it's a logitech and goes on to say english battery removal for recycling how to do that so that means that the battery can be removed and potentially replaced it's a lipo battery that's a lithium phosphate i think that's what it is and uh there's some other foreign scripts here. let's put that aside so we've got a cable here one side is a Looks like a micro USB. It's not a USB-C. This size is a standard USB connector, it looks like. And then here is the actual device. The Logitech is here. This is what it says, let's see. On is up, Bluetooth. Connect to your computer and use mxsetup.logi.com. That's the power switch. You can see it's stuck. You can see it flashing, trying to sync. We'll come back and sync this later. We'll bring a MacBook Air and we'll sync that up. Let's move this out of the way and get ready. So here we are. We've got the MacBook Air. We've got the mouse and we've got a switch here. We'll turn that switch on and I'll try and connect. While it's doing that, we'll go here to find Bluetooth. And let's go over to Bluetooth. And notice we're flashing here, there's a little number one. So possibly you can connect to devices two and three. So got that set up. Anywhere, MX, right there. So we'll roll over there and connect to the Anywhere MX. And the mouse is actually working. So here we are scrolling. So let's close this window and run a Safari. And let's open Safari. And we're in Apple. And we can see the mouse cursor here, it's rolling up and down. So that's working. And there's one other feature that's worth highlighting. Pick up the mouse and we go to the back. We see here, one, two, three. So this first one is currently Bluetooth synced to the MacBook Air. The second one is synced to the iPad. And you could sync the third one. We haven't synced it to it and you can see it's flashing to connect. So one is connected to the MacBook Air, two is to the iPad and three is looking to connect. So that's another added touch that makes this a very nice mouse. And there it's connected and it's working. I hope that helps. Thanks so much for watching.